the British did not win the War of 1812. Wars are not won because you burnt down a building, be it the Capitol building. Here's the thing. I understand that a lot of British chauvinists and people in Britain at the time thought that burning down the Capitol would be so demoralizing to the Americans that we would quit fighting and we would surrender and come to terms for the British. But it actually kind of caused the opposite to happen. In fact, if anything, it just pissed off the Americans and led us to fight on, winning several of the next upcoming battles. Now, how was the war actually ended? Well, it was ended by the Treaty of Ghent on December 24th, 1814. And it was negotiated by both the Americans and the British, which ended with the result of it being inconclusive. Anglo-American status quo, antebellum, Spanish control over West Florida, weakened and mobile territory claim, and Tecumseh's confederacy decisively defeated and dissolved. So the historical consensus is basically we fought to a draw. And there are really no other ways of looking at this. The Americans didn't surrender. The British didn't surrender. We came to peace negotiations and then agreed to quit fighting because we were both happy with going back to status quo. Now, all of you love bringing up the burning of the White House, but I wonder why you never bring the Battle of New Orleans, which was the last major battle of the War of 1812. And we kicked your ass. Now, technically, this battle happened after the signing of the Treaty of Ghent, but that treaty had not been ratified by Congress yet because it had not yet reached the United States. Despite a British advantage in numbers, training, and experience, the American forces defeated a poorly executed assault in slightly more than 30 minutes. The Americans suffered 71 casualties, while the British suffered 2,000, including the deaths of Commanding General Major General Sir Edward Puckenham and his second in command, Major General Samuel Gibbs. So here's the thing. At the end of the day, the British did not win this war. And the fact that some of you are basically coming up with a historical revisionist narrative to try to pretend you won it when the war kept fighting on for quite a bit after that is kind of laughable. And the facts are this. The Americans, many of them actually opposed the terms of the Treaty of Ghent and wanted to continue fighting on. And the longer this war goes on, the more it favors the Americans and not the British. But you don't want to talk about that.